You must construct additional pylons. Welcome back, everybody, to more Skyrim here on Additional Pylons Games. We're here. We met up with uh, Hiraleth and her contingent of guardsmen. We're here at the Western Tower. To see the damage. Figure out what's going on. If there's a uh, dragon on the loose. While they do that, I'm going to discover the Western Watchtower. Garmer and I are going to come over here and find a burnt corpse and loot it. <laughs> um, we'll take that. Kinneret, save us. Here he comes again. Here he comes. Find cover and make every arrow count. Make every arrow count. There he is. The big boy. All right. Swoop in low. Uh, not sure where you, where you went. Oh, wow. All the you. He's talking to me. Oh, that's a big mess. All right. Near. Right, pretty soon here, he should uh, should do his little crash landing thing where he stays on the ground permanently. that again. <laughs> uh, whoops. Whoops a daisy. All right. Give that another go. I forget that I'm not a, uh, I forget that I'm not Ramadi anymore. I forget. Not Hulky and Tor. Sometimes the accents are a little much. Let's save us. Here, Here he comes, comes again. again. Here he comes. Find cover and make every arrow count. All right. We never should have come here. All right, Nermanir. Round two. War to the dragon. Dude, you're like pointing over there. I really expect to hit the dragon by when you can't even point in the right direction. Get him, Garmer. Get him. Magic. Yes. My power. It's over 9,000. <laughs> All right, there we go. Yeah. All right. Shouts menu. Shouts. 
unrelenting force. Favorite? Equip? Optional. Use my new shout. Boom! Here? There we go. I'm super special. I can't believe it. You're Dragonborn. Don't care. All right Dragon. then. All right then. What are you talking about? All right. Back to White Run. Why is it not letting me? For some reason or other, it didn't want me to go right up to Dragon's Reach. So whatever. Anyways. So there we are. Now we've got a Dragonborn who's also a vampire. Very interesting. Very interesting concept when you think about it you've got a um, we're causing no trouble all oh level up yes level up. let's go ahead in Ooh, there's the double keen symbol we got uh going for health custom fit let's get that armor increase because we don't want to die again uh which is why i went for the health as well had the little double keen uh, call from the Greybeards, but we're going to basically ignore them, because now we've got what we wanted. We've got the dragons coming back, we've got the ability to use shouts, absorbing you know, dragon souls, that sort of thing, and uh, that's basically where we're going to leave the, the main quest line at. Uh, we're going to continue on with the quest line for Dawnguard, just as soon as we turn in the last part of this quest finish it off and get our proper reward and uh make sure that make sure that uh mr bogriff here knows that you're finally here the yarl has been waiting for you is uh you his heard realm is safe. something so what happened at the watchtower was the dragon there sure was i knew i could count on irileth but there must be more to it than that how do you know uh i absorbed its so power it's true Greybeards really were summoning you. Who are the Greybeards? Masters of the Way of the Voice. They live in seclusion, high on the slopes of the throat of the world. The throat of the world. What do they want with me? The Dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the voice. The voice. The ability to focus your vital essence into it's an a American doom TV show. Or shout. If you really are Dragonborn, if you're Dragonborn and they master can the teach voice, you how to you'll get a recording contract and you'll hang out with a bunch of famous stars. Beards. Didn't you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? Blah, blah, that was the voice blah, blah, blah. of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Rothgar. This hasn't happened in Thrust. centuries, at least. You said you could sit Not down. Not since Tiber Septim himself was summoned when he was still Talos of Atmora. Oh. Rangar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Your friend Capable here he can be. shout your skull I don't see any the signs of him being this... Crack it open. What? Dragonborn. Let me show you, sir. What nonsense. Why, you right. Maybe that was ignorant. Okay, there you go. These are our sacred traditions. Thank you for uh, saving me from, founding of from the a rash empire. decision, Prongar, you look don't lovely, be so Tiana. hard on Avin. All right. I meant no disrespect, of course. It's just that... What do these Greybeards want with him? That's the Greybeard's business, not ours. Not ours. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon, it revealed something in you. The power that's that inside. The Greybeard's heard of it. If they think you're dragonborn, who are we to argue? Nobody. You better get up to High Hrothgar immediately. Okay. There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeard's. I'm going to go ahead and refuse the summons of the Greybeard's. Honor. I envy you, you know, to climb the 7,000 steps again. What? I made the pilgrimage what? once. Did you know Why that? Why is everybody staring at me? Why are you staring at me? Go lay down. peaceful place. Very no, not you. disconnected They're... from the <sighs> troubles of this world. Serana. I wonder if <sighs> the Greybeards even to the dog, what's Serana. going on down here. Unbelievable. They haven't seemed to care before. Also, 7,000 steps, it's, I think no, there's only like 200 go steps. Go to High like Hrothgar. I'm not exactly sure. Learn what the great it's definitely not 7,000. Although 7,000 is a very nice You've done a great man. service for me Sounds and my very city. very religious. Sounds Dragon very Ball. spiritual. Right. By my right as Yarl. Axe of White I name Thank you. you. I'm going to go ahead and disenchant it if it's it has any. It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. All right. 
I assign you Lydia as a personal house car. Mm, sassy Lydia. And this weapon I will from not my be taking Lydia. To serve I'll be taking Serana. Badge of office. The rest of this because I'll what, also we need her too because of your new type. plenty of sassy Lydia in Wouldn't my other them to think Skyrim you're part Let's of the play. common rabble uh, now would I didn't. Unarmed we are Khajiit. honored to have you as thane of our city, Dragonborn. Thank you. Back to business, Proventus. We still have a city to defend. Yep. Yes, my lord. Come on, Serana. Up we go. All right. Uh. Barangar. Come to Dragon's Reach to me. Can I hmm. sell you any job? I had you figured for a mage. I think you'll appreciate this. And that, and that. Yeah, sure. There we go. You know, if you've got the aptitude. Go ahead and disenchant. Racks of White Run. Wow, that is a. Open axe with soul stuff on it. All right, dwindling frost. Take that. Minor smithing. We'll disenchant that. And blade of woe. No, we'll keep that just because it's a very special blade. All right. <clears throat> so there we are. We are almost full on our gear weight again. Uh, there's Serana. What a derp. What a derp. Yes. Can I give Anything you good? any of my dragon? Let's see if we can get rid of some stuff here. Ooh, wow. Let's just get rid of as much junk as we can. All right, there we go. So, definitely gonna have to unload a bunch of stuff later, probably after this episode. The Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. That's great. It's an honor to serve you. Yep. Peace. Peace. All right, so there we are. We have finished. We've got our magic powers. We are now Mr. Uh, Mr. Skyrim. Somewhere other. Uh, let's go ahead and we're gonna go down to the inn here and speak to the innkeeper. See if we can learn anything about uh about a moth priest who may have come through this way. I breathe now. In royalty, and this do, 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 do. Onward we go. So speaking of, <coughs> we were just talking. I was just talking about my other let's play, um, <coughs> my unarmed Khajiit let's play. So for those of you who are faithful followers, come on in. Just stoke the fire. Oh, thank take you. This is a local favorite. Oh, Sam Govine. I wish I could I take the time to do your quest. But I enjoy this work it. well enough. Have you heard about Have anything I about heard anything? Moth Priest? It was the talk of the city for three days straight. Okay, take it, it easy. Too often we get a visitor like that. Yeah, okay. Oh, Where is he? He just left a short while ago. He said he'd finished up his work and it was time to move on. Hmm. That's all I can tell you. He asked me not to let anyone know where he was going. I suppose he didn't want the attention. Oh, it's It's very like important. I said, I'm not going to talk about it. I can see that. He said he was heading for Dragonbridge next. I hope that helps you. Yes, it does. Alright, let's get out of here before Mr. Bard starts singing about uh, Roar the Red and Dragonbridge. Uh, we've been to Dragonbridge. We had a very lovely time in Dragonbridge. Uh... Spying on a son. Yes. Spying on the son of the captain of the Emperor's Guard before we use that to frame his son for an assassination attempt on the Emperor. Anyways, <coughs> like I was saying, uh, for those of you who are fans of my Skyrim stuff, uh, sorry, what is going on? Um, <coughs> definitely not done with my. Uh, Need something? I'm waiting. Okay, Tassius. You're very... Make yourself awesome. useful and chop up some firewood. Working hard? Mock me. Nah, I don't think so. Uh, don't really care about your troubles with your wife. Uh, that sounds like something you guys need to work out on your own. Seen some mean-spirited folk pass through lately. A moth priest? Try asking one of the guards. That's fair. Mm -hmm. Um... You're a well-traveled sort. If you're looking for a room, you. you want the four shields. Anyways. 
So I'm not uh, done with my. Uh, so that was a moth priest then. I'm not done with he my. Rode through town let's not play long ago with an escort of soldiers. For the unarmed they didn't stop. Just headed south across the Dragon Bridge. All right. Mm -hmm. Thank you for your help, kind guard, sir. Gonna search the road. Shadowmere. Let's go ahead and turn around. You are completely useless. Uh, so yeah, uh, it's it's funny. Um, the only thing I, I don't know, not the only thing, but it seems that there's a lot of requests to have my to continue my uh, my let's play of Ramadi, the heavyweight Khajiit boxing champion of the world. Um, investigate the scene. Nice. Uh, there seem to be a lot of requests to look back over it and, you know, continue it. So, just curious as to what it is about that... Oh, vampire. Oh, okay. Just curious as to what it is about that Let's Play that everybody seems to like so much. So, if you have watched my Let's Play on... Uh, poor horsey. What the hell is it not? That's leather. Um, so, if you've watched it, tell me why. Why do you want me to keep going? I'm not, you know, not that I didn't enjoy it. I'm just curious as to what it is about that Let's Play that everybody's so, so intrigued about. Prepare for an ambush just south of Dragon Bridge. Take the Moth Priest to the Forebearer's holdout for safekeeping until I can break his will. All right. There we go. Capture the Moth Priest. On our way to capture the Moth Priest, then. Should be just right up there. Got all the alchemy ingredients that we can pick up. All the alchemy ingredients that I don't miss. Uh, huh, iron tree mill. Okay. Yes, yeah, so we got some blood spatters going on here. Uh, yeah. So just, just curious. What, what do you guys like so much about uh? about the unarmed Khajiit Let's Play. What is it that you like about it? Let me know. Post something in the comments. And, uh, I don't know. I'm just curious. Really, really no, really no reason other than just simply wanting to, wanting to know more. Weapons used by Dungar do extra damage when attacking vampires. Interesting. It's a very interesting looking axe design as well. All right. Here we are, in another cave. Ugh, mushrooms. Funny, I'm such a big fan of mushrooms here in Skyrim, and I absolutely detest them outside of it. I just feel like they're a complete waste of time and money. Um, let's go ahead and line up our shot. <gasps> Dawnguard wolves. Wow. Dawnguard huskies. Took, my, took too much time on huh? Alright. Right in the butt. <laughs> Alright. Can we? Yes, we probably can hit this guy. does. Boom. Right in the butt. In the butt. Yeah. yeah. Alright, we'll just wait for him to come, come across. Alright. Come here, buddy. That's another Dawn Guard. Sneak increase to 69. There. Well, that was pretty easy. <laughs> Alright, Dawn Guard. Wow. Six for. Ooh. Wow. Your stuff. 
Sells pretty well. Oh, took that axe. Let's see. Uh, one guard war axe. Thirteen. That's not a good. It's not too great. That's not too great either. However, that is some good value right there. Take that. You might be in trouble though. With all this dawn guard stuff. Uh, we'll take your bolts. We'll take your arrows. Take your boots. Heavy armor, 42. That's not a good value, actually. <coughs> not a good value to weight ratio. Alright, well, unfortunately, we're going to have to wrap it up here. So, anyways, thanks for tuning in for another episode of the Dawnguard DLC here on Additional Pilots Games. We'll continue this little dungeon next time and uh, keep continuing on with our quest to uh, figure out what's going on here with this, this prophecy. So, thanks again for tuning in, and we'll see you next time here on Additional Pylons Games. Thanks for watching Additional Pylons Games. Click one of the boxes to watch another video, and click the circle to subscribe and join the APG Zealots. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like and share it with your friends. Comment below, and I'll see you next time here on Additional Pylons Games.